Hey guys, now some of you have seen me over this last three years since I started my YouTube channel going from being shaved to stubble to a full-on beard. And some of you asked me in the DMs on social media in the comment section of the videos, Daniel, we like the beard. How do you do it? How do you maintain it? How do you grow it? It's a lot of questions. So. I decided in this video, I'm gonna give you my three best tips for growing and also maintaining a good looking manly beard. Let's get to it. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it up with some work and belief. Now just very quick, if it's your first time here on my channel, welcome to DLA Model Lifestyle. I'm Daniel. If you haven't subscribed yet, then please do and also click that notification bell and then you won't miss any of the next videos. Now let's start with the first tip. Now the first thing and most important thing is to just grow out your beard. If you're a beginner and you're new to growing hair, then don't get scared when you get those patchy areas. Just get through that phase. Your aim is to grow as much hair as you can to get the length you want. So how do you grow your beard faster? Well, there's a few things that you can do. First, you gotta eat the right kind of food that will help your beard to grow. Healthy fats and protein like eggs, spinach, cinnamon, sweet potatoes, oysters, and livers. And then other things that will help your beard to grow are exercise, exfoliating your skin, and then also beard growth supplements. Now remember, when you grow out your beard, you will get certain lengths or phases that you will not like, but you need to push through it to get to the beard you want. Let's move on. The second tip, you gotta trim your beard. While it's growing, don't cut it, just trim it. Keep it styled while it's growing out, but don't trim it too much. Keep it nice and long. And then once you get the length that you want, then you gotta style it and trim it. Always keep your beard neat. Number one, the hair here, below here on your neck, don't let it grow, you gotta cut it. Second, the hair here on your cheekbones, you wanna shave this off. So you'll have a, a line going from here, straight down here to the kind of corner here of your, of your mouth. So you see this line going there? All the hair that's above it here on your cheekbones, get rid of it. Now remember, once you got your beard to the length you want it to be, all you gotta do is just maintain it and trim it every now and then. Some people just think that your beard will just automatically look great once it's grown up. It doesn't work that way. It's the same as your hair here on the top of your head. You need to cut it, trim it, style it. It's the same thing with your beard. And you gotta remember to trim it the right way so that it will fit in with your face shape. So get an adjustable electric shaver that will work for your beard. For example, I like to go from short here at my ears and then longer here to my chin. And of course, you can try different beard styles. There are many, like the long beard, Viking beard, pointy beard, chin strap, long goatee, the full chin beard, Van Dyke, or even the Wolverine beard. There are more styles, just take some time, go check it out and enjoy your beard. The third tip and the last tip is to use the right beard products. The first thing you gotta do is to stay away from normal shampoo and conditioner that you use for your hair. Why? Because the hair here on your face, on your cheekbones, uh, your, your jaw bones are different than the ones here on your head and also the skin. I mean, your scalp is different here than the skin on your face. So you need the right beard shampoo and conditioner or softener that works for your beard because it doesn't have so many chemicals in it and also it will give your beard what it needs to look healthy, shiny and soft. And so right now I'm trying out a South African company called Buffelsfontein. And no, it's not a sponsored video. I'll talk about a few other brands as well in a minute. So again, the first thing you need is really good beard shampoo and a softener, conditioner. And then, very importantly, you need beard oil. So they got these guys, I've used them for a while and they're actually pretty good. Now, you need to know that if you do not use beard oil, your beard will look and feel dry, like grass. Add some good beard oil and you will see and feel the results. It will look healthy, feel soft, 
and you will style it easier. Talking about styling, next what you do need is beard balm, which will help you to style your beard. Just like pomade for your hair, this is the guy you want for your beard. Not only does it help you to style your beard, but it is actually good for it. Now they're very good for you because they usually contain things like beeswax, cacao butter and uh, beard oil, which is good for your beard. For example, Buffelsfontein, um, well, well, they call it Snorsalf. Their language is Afrikaans, which is my first language as well. Wereldberoemde Snorsalf. It contains Bayavas, Tlapperolie, Sandalhoutolie, which is beeswax, cacao butter and sandalwood oil. Next, you need a beard brush and a beard comb. These guys will help you to keep your beard neat and styled. It also helps to distribute the oil and balm evenly into your whole beard. Now, of course, this is just one company called Buffelsfontein Bart Willy, meaning Buffelsfontein is like a buffalo fountain a beard oil. But other good quality brands that you can trust are Honest Amish, Jack Black, and I also like Viking Revolution. Now, of course, guys, like always, I'll add everything for you in the video description so you can go and check it out with their links. So it saves you a little bit of time and you can go and do your own research on it as well. Now, if you want your beard to grow faster, then check out this video here and it's going to help you out. I'll see you there. Cheers, guys.